So dispense quick justice. Those who have to forgive each other, forgive, they embrace, they cry together, and the society gets healed. Here in Kenya, it is punishment after punishment, breaking people's nerves and hearts. Abductions continue, even as we speak, because they look at those agencies who are sending what, wherever, and here we are referring to data protection, which is also getting violated, and they follow young people, they abduct them, they kill them, you will not go unpunished. And that does not mean I'm not a peacemaker. We, we are told here and clearly, you cannot have peace without justice. Yeah, and you can also, also have development, as, as uh, the late Desmond Tutu say, without, no development without peace as well. So these things are not contradictions. The time, the times we live in are perilous times and Kenyans are feeling it. We want to tell Kenyans you are not alone. Broad based we heard over the weekend that kunoingine wana peremende, so I called it <laughs> broad, broad bread based, bread and peremende based <laughs> government. Uh, but that's okay, it's our country. That is not name calling. You can be sure that you will never get from this awardee stone throwing. We will throw stones from our heads. Uh -huh. Maybe sometimes we can do so with sharp criticism. But we will not take a pang and hurt a Kenyan. We will not get a stone and hit a fellow Kenyan. That is the message to the leaders. So let us be very sharp about this. Once again, thank you. Thank you, my brothers here and young Gen C here, Kamau. According to me, broke a world record here, Kenya. He drove from here to Luanda and drove back on Saturday. Young man driving himself. Uh, they have energy also, and they talk like a nifa. They don't follow any protocol. <laughs> they just tell you as you, as, as for sure. We are not the type to walk out of a challenge. We face it head on. There will be need for, in order to consolidate opposition in Kenya, we will work with everybody. But if others walk out, of course we can't. Our sister mother Karua, for example, walked out. She gave notice. I don't think that DAP has given notice, or wiper, or... Um, Jubilee? No, no. So, Chris, just report that nobody is walking out from this side. And, and the ones who have given notice, and because we believe it is good. It is good. And we'll talk to everybody going forward. Yeah? We'll talk to everybody so that we build a strong coalition. So when you talk about strengthening, actually, I think what I can tell you, a time is coming when we'll ask everybody to validate their membership in Azimio and expand. Others come, others leave. Because while well, Kenya Kwanza want to force everybody into one party, right? We want Kenyans to know the space in our side of the coalition. Okay, the question, uh, I hope you have corrected your mind. Sure. Thank you. <laughs>